Hi, I'm new Stocko editor Sara Ines Calderon, and this is your weekly roundup. This week, my top pick was a story about how the LA County Board of Supervisors issued an apology to the Mexican Americans that were deported during the 1930s after the uh, immigration scare uh, following the Great Depression or during the Great Depression. It was a very interesting story, very popular with you all, and I think it's a part of our history that we don't often talk about. So check that out, share it with your friends, um, and you know, look up more if you're interested in that. As far as culture this week, we had some interesting stories. There was a teacher in Texas who ended up telling a student who was being a little bit rowdy to go back to Mexico, so there's a little bit of controversy surrounding that. Uh, Oscar Barajas wrote a story about how he participated in East LA's gentrification. We had a story about George I. Sanchez and the work that he done, he has done. We had a great post from Flaming Tortillas about how to make an easy tortilla soup with a slow cooker. Oh, Helsna wrote a story about how even though she didn't used to really like babies, now she's really into them, but she wants to wait until she's stable to have babies. Thank you. Then we had an interesting post by Destin Mendes about the idea of race. Like, does race exist? Does it not? Is it all in our perception? Those kinds of questions. It really generated a good response from you all. And El Wapo wrote a story uh, timing the evolution of sinvergüenzas throughout history. Everything from uh, Frida Kahlo's unibrow to the origins of Latino tardiness. It's really interesting and funny. Then we had, in political scape, we had um, a young man in, in Houston who's running for office and kind of a profile on him. Then we had a story about how Arizona wants to create an armed militia on its border. We interv- we do- did a story about uh, Sheriff Babo in Arizona trying to deport his lover, Stella Novella. And finally, we did an interview with Richard Carmona, who is a senatorial candidate in Arizona. Very interesting interview. So I'm Sara Inés Calderon. This is your weekly roundup. Thanks so much for reading another week, and I hope to see you back.